So what is going on guys, Chris here bringing you another video and today I didn't think I'd be making this video but I've got the car apart right now because I believe one of the calipers ended up seizing so ended up just being where it was closed all the time and I had a lot of brake dust on the wheel so and then the wheel was getting hot so took it apart and from what I could tell the uh, brake pad well it's just time for new brake pads anyway so this is kind of just what I have going on today. And that's how dirty that this wheel has gotten compared to the others, which I just cleaned this car like two days ago. And well, this is what we're doing now. So I'm about to head to the store and probably end up getting a new caliper and brake pads, of course. But so I did want to make a quick video about what I think that any Mustang owner from 79 to 04 should own. Now that even though I did the coyote swap, this is not draw, this is drive by wire now, but it is still ca uh, cabled where the transmission still has the clutch cable and I don't have an MT82 or anything in this car. So that being said, I would love a hydraulic clutch from McLeod. I know they make one, but it's kind of expensive, not too expensive, but it's kind of not what I'm focused on right now. So what I think anybody that owns these cars from 79 to 04 definitely needs is well this may look like the factory clutch cable it is actually a Steeda one now I'm not sure Steeda actually takes a factory clutch cable and makes it stronger or if they just utilize the same one and put their name on it well this is a firewall adjuster and what that allows you to do is you can set to where the clutch releases from the top or down low so that is the firewall adjuster and it's also a Steeda one and the part that I'm not going to show you but you should definitely replace is the quadrant. Now on these they come plastic which is really cheap and they tend to break very easy. Mine broke very easy but was a bitch to get off. Well when I did the swap it's kind of when everything happened but I went ahead and upgraded to the whole Steeda kit. It ran me about near $125 for everything from AmericanMuscle.com had it shipped within two days of course. I have my clutch cable set up paired with the McLeod clutch, uh, Street Extreme, and the McLeod flywheel, the light and steel flywheel. And then it's also paired with a Pro 5.0 short throw shifter with a Ford Racing shift knob. Now MGW I hear and I have used an MGW in the past on a car reviews for other Mustangs being the New Edge and Fox Body. MGW I have to say is probably the best short throw shifter out there for these cars and probably one of the best in the market for the coyote cars i know barton makes a pretty good one and i know quite a few people that side with mgw though but overall you should definitely upgrade to a adjustable clutch cable and a short throw shifter it makes shifting that much smoother it makes it that much easier to work with and you get a better clutch feel there's one budget friendly mod that i think you guys should just definitely look into buying and it's very simple to install maybe an hour tops with everything and boom you'll feel a lot better driving and the car will be that much smoother and it will look a lot better than the stock crappy shifter and with that being said guys that's going to do it for this video make sure to subscribe for future content follow the build and I hope this little tip on a budget-friendly mod helps you guys in the long run. Just a quick tip. And make sure to smash that like button. And I will catch you guys in the next video. Have a good one.